Don't you dare. Right. He's signing everything. He just signed my toe, man. <laughs> Andre and I'm a black nerd and I'm here with Sabrina Liu. I played Scorpina on um, Goldar's Vice Versa, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, second season, episode 29. Well, it is a pleasure to meet you, Scorpina. <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you, too. What's up, man? I'm good, I'm good. How are you doing? Well, there's about 5,000 people in line behind me. Hey! Uh, hey, hey, hey! Exactly. <laughs> they needed someone to lure the Power Rangers into a trap, so, you know, that was that common story because we're always trying to get them. There was a vice versa dance where the girls asked the boys to a dance and so they needed someone to ask Adam to the dance. They decided Scorpina should go down as a regular student disguised and uh, lure and as it turns out, Adam and Aisha out farther away from the pack, so then I was able to trap them. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you Comic Con, Jeff. Right. I had a blast at Comic Con. Comic Con is nothing compared to Power Morphicon. Instead of 150,000 um, people dressed as the Man Bat, <laughs> we got 25 Red Rangers, 30 uh, Green Rangers, four white guys playing the Black Ranger OG. Yeah. It's kind of strange cosplay <laughs> thing. Only like one alpha is on alpha. They got the biggest hearts though. Yeah. That's the thing about this convention is everybody's super cool. I actually remember that episode and I was just like, I don't know, I'd go with Scorpino to the school dance. I got no problem with that. <laughs> and then of course, it all got discovered before, so I never even got to go to the school dance. Yeah. <laughs> That's no fair. <laughs> I know. This show's been going on for so many years and like people are still, like you got the line going crazy. People well, are loving you. I've been thinking about this for years and I've come to a real important conclusion. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. It really was like, when somebody, they have a vision <laughs> of what they want to do, you know? Wow. It means so much. Yeah. yeah. Is this your first Power Morphicon? Yes, this is my first one. It's been really a lot of fun just to get to see it on all the merchandise and I was so excited because there was a Scorpina sticker. Really glad I got to be here for this. I love it. Man, that's kind of deep right there. I'm I've been thinking about this. <laughs> what is the meaning of life, Paul? <laughs> Choke the guy that killed. <laughs> <laughs> that would be the worst thing ever. The man that killed, that made Maulshire choke. That would not be loved. Yeah. So many opportunities to uh, to leave this plane of existence, and I'm certain that mine will be on Power Rangers doing some crazy stunts or something. I think I'm gonna pull a red fox. <laughs> Everyone asks about playing the Power Ranger, but you got to play a bad girl, so what was that yeah, like? No, it was super fun because I actually got to play a villain pretending to be a good person like a normal student who then traps people and becomes a villain, so it, it was a lot of fun actually. I don't know if you've noticed, but yeah. I've been getting exponentially better looking. Yeah. I was just like a butterball turkey for years, and then slowly I started to actually grow up, kind of. Yeah. And now I look at myself in the mirror and I'm like, damn, you're like ripped. Looking well, kind good. Of, you know, I'm ripped in kind of a post-apocalyptic, kind of there's only four guys left in the world ripped, ripped. <laughs> kind of. My family, is, we're, 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 uh, we're Indonesian and we're, there's Dutch in there. And we also have uh, South American Indian and there's some, uh, there's a little bit of African on my grandma's side. And so I am never going to get rid of my caboose. It, it's never happening. You and me both, brother, man. And, and who would want you? Because, you know, gravitas is <laughs> something <laughs> that starts from within. Yes. Your ass. <laughs> gravitas. To become the uh, scorpion creature. It's not, you know, it's it's not my best look, probably. But <laughs> Definitely a woman you don't want to mess with, I guess. Right, right. I, and Goldar gets big. He still looks like Goldar. I get big. I turn into an entirely different species. So Coming back on the show for the Nickelodeon series, has that been a different experience? Yeah, kind of. Felix is good. Yeah. I mean, he knows he's an army, but he has his own thing. But also, both had to be more parental now. Yeah. I had to be like, I had to chew in my mouth full. <laughs> By far, my favorite interview. So, cool, man. <laughs> Thanks. I, li I like the casual stuff like this. It's good. I'd like to talk about this indie independent movie that I've been making for seven years in my garage. Yeah. I'm still editing, and it's all me, actually, different roles. <laughs> And my mom's in it. But you want to be in it? I'll give you a copy or credit. Oh, cool, yeah. I'll start a Kickstarter campaign for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Kickstarter should come with, and I'm serious, uh -huh. a shock collar. You know how many people donate to Kickstarter and they're like, ah, it's like liking something on Facebook. And then they change their credit card. So all that stuff that they supported on 
Quick start of that. Quick start of doesn't post that to your Facebook. Tom Jones just unsupported the 17 altruistic <laughs> things that he did last week that he blasted in the propaganda. So the wow. shot caller is to penalize you. Yeah. Like if you don't actually pay the money to the to the artist or whoever. <laughs> That's it. Man, Tom Jones is mean. <laughs> I'm a lady. <laughs> we need Scorpina to come back. Would you be down? If they can work it in, you know, do a spin-off or something, Scorpina in space or something like that. Yeah, she settled down with Goldar or something? Right, that's right. Well, there was a baby at some point or something that they said, so, you know, we could totally have the spin-off of the whole family. After Modern Family, a little sitcom about Goldar and Scorpina and their mutant baby children. In daily life, hanging out, going to soccer games. And if your child loses, you grow into giant monsters and crush yeah. their teeth. Well, of course, of course. That would, that would be kind of the, the downside for the uh, losing team. That will be how er every episode ends. Exactly, like, you grow. Exactly. Every episode we just crush anyone in our way. Who would be Paul's exiting quotes? Never be ashamed to love what you love. And love it all the way. Yeah. Oh, oh this guy. This guy. <laughs> Thank you so much. Bye. The worst I would ever ask to do to you is give you a foot rub or something. Oh, wow. I always like a foot rub. Are you saying, what, really? <laughs>